Assalamu alaikum and welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel. I hope you're all doing really well inshallah. Today we're back outside Dorita Travel and Tours. We have booked Kosovo inshallah. We're going to Pristina I think is how you pronounce it. It's the capital. I think it's quite a long drive. I think they told us in the tour office it was about a five hour drive and we should have about an hour and a half to two hours there. So we have now arrived at the international bus terminal in Tirana, Albania. It's five o'clock and our bus is due to leave at 5.40. So we're nice and early again. I love how there's no traffic in the morning. It takes about 10 minutes to get here. We were thinking about maybe leaving at five in the morning, but I thought that 15 minutes could be a lot of traffic. So I just didn't want to risk it. So we're here again, plenty of time before the bus, it looks like. This is what the bus terminal looks like. All of these little mini buses here. It goes all the way down here to the end. So, I'm gonna take you guys along with us and we'll just see what we get up to today. We were just waiting outside down there where we got the bus last time and a bus pulled up and he was actually running a little bit late and when I went and asked him if this was our bus he said no your bus is parked right down the other side so we had to run down we thought we were going to miss it we we're actually one minute late but it's still here alhamdulillah so now we're on the bus heading to Pristina inshallah. <laughs> videos yesterday on Pristina seeing what there is to do I couldn't find any videos at all they were just kind of like regular videos not really giving you recommendations on anything to do so we really have nothing planned at all we're just gonna inshallah turn up have a walk around hopefully get some food I'm not too not too sure how long we're actually gonna have when we arrive um, and then hopefully as well we're gonna get a fridge magnet Welcome to Pristine Kosovo. It's a very misty day today. Just arrived and we have four hours to spend here. So I've just put in the maps the shopping mall so we can go in and have a little look and hopefully find some breakfast. We just stopped in a cafe quickly and got two coffees and we've noticed the last couple of countries we've been in, every coffee you get, you get a glass of water with it, which is really lovely. So. I was really shocked at the price, it seemed like a really posh cafe and two coffees, two waters, well the water's included but two coffees were two euros, so one euro per cup of coffee which is really really good and the coffee was absolutely lovely. Now we're on the way to Skanderbeg Square. There's a square in Montenegro I'm sure called Skanderbeg Square or maybe it's Albania, I might be getting the two confused. But that's where we're going just now. It's a 38 minute walk. And then I've seen another monument there and a shopping mall. So I think that's what we're gonna try and do today and then head back to get that bus at half past two. I think over here, by the looks of it, they're gonna build a stunning mosque. It says Turkey Foundation. Wow, that'll be beautiful. As we're on the way to the square, just walking through this little park bit, there's lots of nice seating areas. And then I'm seeing a building over there in the distance. I'm not too sure what it is. It looks like it's giant footballs all over the roof. <laughs> all the dogs are sleeping in the sun. One, two, three. Oh, they look so peaceful. I think that over there is a church. We've just spotted a souvenir shop over here, so we're going to stop just now and get a magnet before we don't remember where it is and then we end up not getting one. So, just a little shop there on the corner. I 
I think that was the fastest ever deciding which fridge magnet we wanted to take. So now we've headed out and we're at the Skanderbeg Square. This is it here. Tall building. There's dogs just everywhere lying on the floor. <laughs> Absolutely everywhere. As we're walking down I can see a mosque in the distance. So we're just going to walk down here and have a little look. There's the mosque just there and there's also one over there as well. This one reminds me of the one in Bulgaria. It looks very very similar, lovely. <laughs> So I've just come across this here, so I thought I would take a look and it says this memorial is built by 20,145 medals which symbolically honour the versatile contribution and sacrifice of every ethnic Albanian woman during the 1998-1990 war in Kosovo. Wow, I'm not sure if you can see very closely, let me just get a little bit closer, but look at that. That's incredible. As we're walking here, we just come across a big football stadium. Kosovo's football stadium. This here is the newborn monument. Just stopped in a halal restaurant. It's called Burger Bros. We've got a couple of orange juices and two cheeseburgers and chips, and it all came to 10 euros. I can't believe this was three euros each. It looks so good. We both got the same with some spice. you have to go to Burger Bros. It was one of the best burgers I've ever had. Forget McDonald's, KFC, Burger King. Find local restaurants and support them and they were halal so uh, really really good. Definitely recommend it if you're here. That's our time up now. We're on the bus to head back. I'm guessing it's about a three and a half hour journey. I'm not too sure. We're both actually coming down with the cold so neither of us are feeling too great but tomorrow, inshallah, we are heading back to Scotland at half past six. So that's our week already finished here in Albania. We've had such a good time. We've went, uh, we've done three countries in Albania, Kosovo and Montenegro. And yeah, looking forward to the next time we travel again, inshallah. Just made it back, alhamdulillah, there's the hotel. We've had such a great time, such a great week. That's us just back from Kosovo just now and tomorrow we are heading home. Sad that it's come to an end, but what great memories we've made. Have you enjoyed yourself? Oh, I loved every minute of it. I'm sad. <laughs> <laughs> we just need to book another trip then. I know, yeah. <laughs> Definitely. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you've enjoyed this vlog. If you have, give it a thumbs up, give me a comment, let me know what you think, and I'll see you in the next vlog, inshallah. Bye.